Hi, Paul. Hit pause and go get your bass. And your Dragon Eddy music. Okay, you're back. So here's the page 42 of the um, Vance book. This is measure 21. It's the opening phrase after the... Um, it's the first bit of the exposition after the opening phrase. Um, rather than play it on the open string, this D and the second finger on this F sharp, um, you could do that, but you have this open string, which you have to shape something like. this first note. And use your third finger on this F sharp. Okay, so what that gives you is it gives you uh, this uh, first position hand shape. This uh, whole, whole step here from the D to the E and a whole step from the E to the F sharp. Uh, notice that Vance has edited to use second finger through all this all these uh, runs using the second finger here. So you have a whole step, whole step, and a whole step. And what that does for me is it it has created this kind of awkward stretch here between first and second finger. Uh, and my intonation is suffering. So I've discovered that in the last, uh, the last few days, in this last week. So on that top line, second measure, the F sharp, there's a two over it, write a three over it. In the third measure, there's a two over that C sharp. Here that's on the A string, put a three over that. Uh, and also later on, you see that same C sharp uh, in the second beat, put a three over that. And then you see that same two over the F sharp, put a three over that. And then on the last, the third beat of the third measure there, measure 25, there is a two over the B natural, put a three over that. So you have something like this. And on this half note, this half note in measure 23, what I'm doing, rather than put your thumb behind the neck, because if you have your thumb there, it has to come out to make this transition to this hand shape. So what I'm doing is I'm keeping my thumb out and prepared on the second, on the um, second string, because it's going to go up to here, like this. Okay, so I'm having that prepared. I'm having my third finger prepared on the second string also. So I'm going to play this D, and I'm going to vibrate. If you're standing. I'm sitting currently. If you're standing, um, you can still vibrate it um, by having your thumb on the side of the fingerboard. Okay. Here's my thumb right here. It's resting on the side of the fingerboard. Could put it up here, uh, but then you'd have to rest the, sh the, the neck of the bass on your shoulder at this point, which 
which wouldn't be bad actually. So you already have your your, your hips back, your knees bent, uh, and you got the, the neck of the bass on your shoulder. Your thumbs already on the second string on the D string. first finger and then I'll make it wider like this for this video the next video will cover the next uh, the next four measure phrase okay